What is up guys, today we're going to be talking about Mad Cat's products and why they suck so bad. So, so let's get right into it. But before we get started, huge shout out to my sponsor G2A. Click the link down below to get games up to 90% off. It's amazing. And subscribe to get free games. So in New York City, I recently bought a pair of Triton headphones from GameStop. That's what the guy recommended to me. I got home, tried them with my Xbox, and the microphone didn't work. So I went to GameStop by my house and be like, and I was like, hey, what up? They don't work. And he was like, yeah, Triton suck. Don't buy them. So I returned them and got a very steep priced pair of Turtle Beaches, and they're amazing. So, question is today, why do Mad Cat's headphones suck? And it's not just their Triton line of headphones. I've read online multiple people complaining about other products that just plain old suck. So what's the deal? So, so far in my life, I've purchased two Mad Cat's products. The first one was an Xbox 360 headset, which I still have. It's underneath my desk in my drawers. The second one was the Xbox One headset that got returned. The only reason I still have my Mad Cat's headset for the 360 is because they worked, and I was too poor to buy anything Turtle Beach. The headset for the Xbox One worked 100% perfectly with my phone, the platform it was not intended to work with. So as soon as I found out that I wasn't the only one having problems with that headset, the next day I went to GameStop and returned them. Then I promptly bought expensive Turtle Beach headphones, because I'm not poor anymore. So the question is, why does Mad Cat suck? Well, the answer is, Mad Cat sucks because they're focused on price, not quality of product. So you buy something, $40, you're paying $40 for like a $10 headset. It's not that good. The lady at GameStop said, to get a good Mad Cat's product, you need to pay upwards of $300. And I believe that. Their wireless headphones look amazing. I don't know how they sound, but they look amazing. Much better than the $50 ones I bought. So there's your answer. Mad Cat sucks because they're just plain old cheap. And hey, Mad Cats, if you want to try to change my mind, send me one of those $300 wireless Xbox One headsets. Just saying. If you think I'm right in the fact that Mad Cat products suck, like the video. If you don't, dislike the video. Don't forget to subscribe for them giveaways. Peace.